Hi mga fam, ati Mara here. For today's video, ituturo ko sa inyo step by step kung paano tayo makakapagsend ng pera from our micro savings account or easy buwana account papunta sa another easy buwana account po via scan QR code. So anyway guys, alamin din natin kung free ba ito, instant din ba siya. And kung interested kang malaman paano nga ba ito, please keep on watching. Hi guys, andito tayo sa ating Easy Buwana account. Punta tayo sa Send Money. After niyan, may apat na options po para makapag-send tayo ng pera. First is yung Send Money to Other Banks. Tapos pangalawa, to Other Cebuana Bank Account. Pangatlo, yung Cash Pickup at any Cebuana Lulier Pawn Shop. And lastly, yung Scan QR Code. Out of all, I think yung pinaka-convenient of all ay itong Scan QR. At ito yung gagawin natin ngayon. By the way guys, kung gusto nyo malaman yung step-by-step -step video tutorial kung paano mag-send ng pera to other banks, to other Cebuana Bank account, and yung Cash Pickup at any Cebuana Lulier Pawn Shop, ililink ko na lang po yung videos nila down below. So make sure to check it out, okay? So, punta tayo sa scan QR code, tap next. After nyan, ayan, allow si Buana to take pictures and record video. So, kung kasama mo naman right now, yung gusto mong pagsenda ng pera, then that's good. As mo lang siya ng, ng QR code ng kanyang si Buana account, okay? Hindi pwede ka namang makapag-import from your photo gallery po. So, tap lang natin tong import from photo gallery and then photos then after nyan madadirect ka sa album mo so hanapin mo lang yung QR code hanapin ko lang dito guys ha for example this one let's see ayan as you can see kapag na scan na po yung QR code automatically mag appear na po yung details nung pagsasendan mo Alright, so hindi mo na kailangan mag-enter ng account number or ng name nung padadalhan mo kasi nga um, nag-scan QR code ka. So ang gagawin mo na lang, after niyan, lagay mo na lang dito yung ama na gusto mong i-transfer. Guys, take note ha, hindi po free yung scan QR code. Um, may charge po, convenience fee na 10 pesos. So nakakalungkot because, you know, si Buwana account din naman ito, ba? Diba? Same is true as well with sending to another Cebuana account, right? May charge po na 10 pesos. Now, let's see kung pwede tayo makapag-transfer ng 100 pesos. Confirm and send lang po tayo. And as you can see, minimum transfer amount po for EFT is 400 pesos. So, same lang din kapag magpapadala ka to any or to other Cebuana account po. So, 400 yung minimum. Lagay ko lang dito 400. Confirm and send. After nyan, may OTP. So, enter lang natin dito yung OTP, guys. Okay. 617261. Submit. And as you can see, guys, your transaction is successful. Ayan yung reference number. Ang haba, no? And... Nag-transfer po tayo na 400 pesos via QR code. Okay? And then, ito yung transfer from, transfer to, and then yung convenience fee na 10 pesos. Tapos yung amount, all in all, nagbayad po tayo na 410 pesos. Okay? Pwede natin tong screenshot, guys. Pwede natin tong screenshot, guys. Pwede natin tong screenshot, guys. And ito yung ipakita natin dun sa pinadalhan natin para may proof kasi... When you tap home, ayan, tapos punta tayo sa account balance, hindi mo siya makakita dito sa transaction guys. As you can see, ngayon, nakita mo yung charge lang na 10 pesos yung nakalagay dito. Hindi dito nakalagay yung 400 na nabawas sa account mo as well. So, kung gusto mo malaman yung full details ng transaction na to, you need to visit the Cebuana branch. Medyo hassles siya, ba? Pero yung kinawa ko kanina, nag-screenshot ako before ako nagpunta sa home. Nang sa ganun, meron tayong proof na nakapag-send nga tayo. Okay? Walang reason para sabihin nila, no, 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 hindi ko na-receive kasi meron kang proof doon. Alright? So, ganun lang kasimple mag-send ng pera via QR code po. Although, it's very convenient pero may charge po siya. Pero ang kagandahan, hindi siya depende sa amount. So, 
per transaction po yung 10 pesos na charge. Alright? So guys, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to comment down below. At kung hindi ka pa part ng Mika fam, please make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell para updated ka every time meron tayong bagong videos, meron bagong updates, and meron giveaways for you. So thank you so much. I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.